everyone. I'm extra skinny today. I'm gonna look fat. Oh no, I looked at myself in the mirror and I was like, I look cute today. I look skinny today. And now that I look at myself here in the viewfinder, I look fat all over again. I, honestly, it's your fault. Click the link below and get yourself a cameo where I'll make a special video just for you. Treat yourself or surprise someone else. It makes a great gift. Link below. Peasants. So since y'all can't get enough into me, I, I always say to myself, when are these people gonna say, you know what? We've watched him eat long enough. We know that we know how to eat. We know how he eats. Why do you watch Nikocado? Oh, I want to see how he eats. Okay, but he eats every day. Yeah, but I just want to make sure he swallows. Yeah, he does swallow. Clearly, he's getting fatter. Well, you never know. I just want to make sure he's not one of those cheater YouTubers that take a bite, spit it out, and edit out the cuts. <sighs> well, he gained 200 pounds on camera, Ashley, so clearly he's, he's swallowing that food. Okay. Okay, but how many times do you have to watch him? I don't know. I'm going to watch one more week. Okay, the week is over. Why are you still watching? I don't know. You know how I eat now. You know how I eat. Are you surprised? Like... Y'all are still here. <clears throat> I can't get rid of these people. And people say, Nick, you should be more grateful. I'm never grateful. And plus, y'all like to be degraded. Today, I'm gonna be eating something very healthy. I have to go make it. It involves lots of cheese. We have a cup for the cheese. We're gonna do some epic cheese bowls. Is this enough cheese? That's gonna be too small. And also, we need some Cheetos. We are gonna do some flaming hot Cheetos because I want some flaming hot behind. Tonight, like a wasp in the toilet. That's what I'll be doing. So I haven't had hot Cheetos on this channel for a very long time. And the last time I, ch I checked this channel, well, I just Googled, or excuse me, searched on YouTube. They should, what's the name for search on YouTube? You, you know, say, I Googled this, I Googled that, I Googled this. How do you say I YouTube searched it? I YouTubed, there we go. I YouTubed my name, Nikocado Cheetos, hash browns. I've done this many times. A million views, two million views, one million views, 900,000 views. I got one that was kind of average, like 300,000 views, but it was cause it was those black bean noodles maybe, I don't even know. So this is actually very popular and I haven't done it forever. However, the reason why I haven't had hot Cheetos anything in this place for over a year it's because it requires manual labor. And you know what I think about manual labor. Not for me, I'm already sweating just existing. I'm literally hot from existing. There's no way you're gonna find me chopping stuff up, mixing stuff up, bending over and putting stuff away, standing up and bringing stuff down from the cabinets, mixing and all this huffing and puffing. I'm sorry, I don't have that many calories to spare. Sorry, this hotel's full, go somewhere else. However, I'm really greedy and I'm really desperate for money and the fact that he's got lots of views, I'm like, okay, I can make a couple hundred, a million views, boom, $200 right there. And you know, I'm desperate. I finally paid off my camera. Remember I broke it like two weeks ago? I thought I could get it done in like six or seven days, but no, I had all the other things and these bills come at the, uh, the end of the month. So, all right, I need some money. So we're gonna be doing something that better get a lot of clicks. For those of you that follow me on other social media platforms, you know I recently posted my earnings from Tick Tick. I got 10 million views last month. 10 million, well then again, I didn't post that much, but I earned $11. $11 for 10 million views. Okay, what if I got 1,000 views like a normal person? One penny! One penny for you. You might as well quit, Ashley. You might as well quit. There's no more views. So, I'm honestly losing my money and I'm also losing my mind. Things are getting more expensive. Every time I go to pump my car full of gas, and this is why I try not to use it that much. Because here it's $6 a gallon. I remember last year it was like two. Two, Ashley, two. Two dollars. It's quadrupled or tripled. I don't think enough is made. You know, I almost feel like I wonder because they, you see on the news, they're like, oh, you know, Biden did. You see, I, I saw at Costco a sticker that said, but I did this and it's Biden pointing in a little bumper sticker. I'm not an economical, economic, economics type of person. I don't even know. I can't, I don't even know how to invest. I'm bad with money. I spend it all. But for those of you that are into money and you know how these things work, 
half the people say it's his fault, half the people say no, it's Trump's fault, and the other half say it has nothing to do with any of them. The, the price of the oil is the same as it was before the you-know-what, the pandemic. And it's the company saying, we're just gonna like milk this real hard. We're just gonna milk this and make the poor peasants pay. And people are saying they're doing it deliberate to, to make Biden look bad because half the country doesn't know they're stupid, you know? I don't know. Do they even know if it's his fault? Oh, he could have done the Keystone Pipe. I don't know. I really don't know anything about any of this. But I saw a conspiracy that they're saying, oh, no, these companies are doing this on purpose so that everyone um, blames the wrong person. Ah! <laughs> because those companies love their tax cuts. Isn't that how this goes? See, this is why I don't talk about politics because I just don't know. I'm one of these people that uh, I just want to eat. I want to eat my food and take off my clothes. That's it. That's all I really want to do in life. I don't care what these people are doing. Just don't make me pay too much for my gas. I don't know who's in charge or whose fault it is, but figure it out. Figure it out. Here, put that on TikTok. That's my message. Brought to you by the peasants. I represent all peasants of this country. We don't know how this works. We don't know who to blame. But you better figure it out because at the end of the day, I'm wasting my money to scoot my hoodie from the couch to the store to eat to survive. Anyways, we're going to go get Hot Cheetos. I ran out of Hot Cheetos, but you know what? I still have some left over, but they're expired. You know what? Times are tough. We're eating the expired Cheetos. Here's the thing. When I buy a bag of Cheetos to do a Cheetos recipe, which was last year, have you noticed, peasants? I haven't made a Hot Cheetos video on this channel for years. Sorry, I was burping. Acid reflux. My body's hungry. For years. It's been over a year since I've made a Cheetos concoction. And the reason is I'm too fat. It takes a lot of work and I have to make more than do it because, you know, that's labor. Here's the thing. So I open up a bag of Cheetos. I only use a little bit for the recipe. And then there's a bag left over. What do I do, Misha? What do I do? So I take the bag. I put it in a big old little ziploc -y, and I just store it. I'll be like, I'll use this for my next recipe. It's been a year. That stuff is so stale and so hard. I don't, mm, it's expired. But again, times are tough and I'm desperate for money and I'm not about to go spend $20 on an Uber to go to the grocery store and pick up inflated Cheetos, inflated bags of eggs, and inflated butters and bring it here for these peasants. So I'm gonna pretend that it's fresh so I get paid more. Okay, so I don't want to hear any Nick picking like, oh my god, he used old Cheetos from last year. You know what? Unless you cash at me my, well, I don't have that, but unless you mail me a check, boo. I can't afford more Cheetos, and I can't afford the gas to go get them either. And you could go to the store to get the Cheetos because you can afford the gas and your time, and then there's none to be found. There's just no more. Just like yesterday, I had a late night little binge. I went to Wendy's. <laughs> It was so good. Oh my god, but I also was really upset because they had the wrong buns They ran out of this. They ran out of that. They ran out of everything and they're like due to unprecedented times Well, figure it out. I'm hungry. Americans are getting angry There's no food left in this place. There's nothing to eat in this place I'm honestly well luckily my McDonald's still has everything I need to be fit and healthy so we're doing McDonald's soon. I'm honestly, I love McDonald's. Oh, and that Popeyes, I actually didn't get that sick because I had a big mukbang later that day. <laughs> Again, we did Popeyes yesterday and then last night I did Wendy's. Um, that was a private little binge and <laughs> all that food pushed it out. So that's the problem with sometimes, like the food makes you sick. You have to keep eating to push it out. And I don't wanna hear, oh, just eat fiber. No, you just eat, you just need volume in general. Lots of water. Anyways, I'm kind of going on a tangent. But the Popeyes, that spicy chicken, the spicy chicken uh, sandwiches, I think I'm going to do Popeyes again. That was so good. I want to do it again. Except this time I want to go all out. I want to get the nuggets and the tenders and the red beans and rice and the butterfly shrimp and french fries. I want to get everything. And by the way, I finished the chicken sandwich and I ate the whole second thing of mac and cheese last night on top of my Wendy's binge. So if I look a little fat today, it's just water weight, but I swear I looked skinny when I woke up. But when I look at myself in the camera, I'm like, wow, I'm fat. All right, it's time to do the recipe. 
I'm gonna call this video a recipe, because it is, because I'm gonna show you people how to do it. Here are the ingredients that you need. Eggs. Cheetos. A pan to fry. Vegetable oil. I actually, no, we're gonna use canola oil, which is healthy. Er. Look it up, canola oil is actually very healthy for you. It has no saturated fat, amazing. And according to some vegans out there, they say it's the best oil to eat because it has high ALA um, oh, uh, fatty acids. A uh, good fatty acids. Okay, I'm about to drink that. Um, what else do you need? And a servant to make it. Luckily, I have Orlin. I can't be bothered to do manual labor. You need someone to do the work. A peasant. Find a peasant and get them. Oh, that sounds horrible. <laughs> that sounds horrible. I'm different because I'm married to the fool, but that's all you need. No milk, no eggs. I mean, yes, eggs. No milk, no flour, no sugar, no nothing. It's so simple. Eggs, Cheetos, oil, and a pan. And a servant. <clears throat> all right. And a big appetite. Oh, and the cheese. I have two ingredients. You need the best mozzarella on earth. It's called Galbani. I'm gonna link it down below. It's my favorite. I buy it on Amazon. It's the best cheese. I also check out the price. I don't know if they're going up in this economy. And things, oh, by the way, keep good and out of stock, out of stock, out of stock, out of stock. First of all, I bought like 27 blocks. <laughs> with the food. I bought all the blocks so the, pe the peasants could have any experiences. So I bought seven, 27 blocks of the cheese and also you need a big old can of nacho cheese and you're gonna mix it together and it's gonna be a cheese pull. Let's get started. I'll see you in the kitchen. Okay, peasants. Step one is crack your eggs. Look how clean this egg is. Shh. We'll just wipe it off. One of the best for my sweetie. Don't, don't get, we'll wipe that one first. Honey, wipe, wipe the, the poop off. Only the best for you. Anyways, um, you're gonna take some eggs and you're gonna put it into the bowl. Step one. And I would recommend doing a small bowl so it's easier to manage and whisk it around with the whisks, which are over there. So you didn't listen to me. I'm, I don't care about what you say. I'm currently chewing. You're fat, you can't stop eating. So he's making those eggs go round and round. See, that's why I told you they'll all fly around. How about you do it? I don't have the muscles. I warned him and he didn't listen to me. You should only do like five at a time, but he did, I don't even know how many that was. But anyways, when you're done with that, they're gonna take these Cheetos over here. I have lots left over. These might have expired last year. I don't care because I identify as skinny. So when you're healthy, you can eat stuff. Your body won't react. That's my opinion. So you're gonna take these and we're gonna put it into a blender. And you're gonna blend it into a fine powder. All right, so you're gonna start with about half him. Those little bad boys in there. Okay, do a little bit more. Okay, <gasps> Ooh, I'm already getting hungry, I'm burping. I'm gonna bring it down over here. <sighs> it takes a long time, because he's fat. You keep dropping the clumsy. You dropped it. No, it's because you're so... Okay, and now you take it out. So it came out into fine little pieces. Now I usually do these puffs over here, but we don't have enough and these expired. So I'm like, let's make use of them because I'm greedy and poor. All right, get my money's worth. It honestly looks the same. Does it? Yeah. Oh, know what it was? Maybe it was the uh, the way it fries. Didn't these turn black or something? I don't know, we'll find out. We'll find out. If it turns black, you have to do the air fryer. But right now we're gonna use the oil. And this is, did you know canola oil is healthy? It has no saturated fat, like one gram. Everything else is polyunsaturated and monounsaturated, which means it's healthy. This is gonna become a hood classic meal now. Ugh, that's what they say in my comment sections. It is gonna break my blunder, oh you're not, okay.
cheapers, creepers. Look at all that smoke coming out. What's all that? Oh, that's pa that's canister. Did you burn it? Nope. What's the smoke? Why is it smoking? It's extra healthy. No, but it, why is it smoking? What is that? It's probably from all the motions, just powdered up one, like dust. The dust. The dust. The dust. This comes out really nice. The dust. Yeah, because it's two years old, honey. It's already been disintegrating. Age. Age like, like fine wine and fine cheese. Mm -hmm. Two year old Cheetos. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. That's what I'm talking about. Age like fine cheese. Mm hmm. Age like fine cheese. Mm hmm. Mmm. Okay, from the oil being poured. Here comes some health. Health is wealth. Health is wealth. Oh, for healthy. All of it for extra healthness. I didn't know it had no unsaturated. It had no saturated fat. This is healthy fats. You should drink some for breakfast. Step number size. I mean five. Put it into the egg. No. You're allergic to eggs. I am allergic to eggs. Well, this came out warm. You, because you cooked it. It was smoking. Oh. You smoked it. Extra healthy. They're the eggs. I feel like I have to coat it real good. Look how easy this was. We're going to do this with cheese real soon, aren't we, It's honey? so easy that you don't do it yourself, huh? I'm crippled. Di I'm diabetic and disabled. I'm, like, barely holding myself up over here. I'm, like, crying. There it is. That's all you get, peasants. If that's not good enough, it's your own faults. Ooh, oh, look at, um, that's a lot of allergy. All those eggs. <sighs> Remember when you did that Cheetos challenge with Carly? Mm. Moving along, moving along, moving along. Now we're about to do the chicken. This here is chicken nuggets. And I know they kind of look like turds. Well, let's, show, let's show them like one. Yeah, let's show them how. You cover it in cholesterol. Step one, cholesterol. And you cover it in health. And then you cover it in health. Health as well. Okay, ouch, my backwards. <sighs> I'm going to get so healthy after this meal. Oh my gosh, there it goes. All right, let's do one of these. They already seal them. They already seal them. Well, these are Eggs. Very exciting. All right. Okay. And then you put it over there. I have to go my backwards. All right. So we are about to put the first victim into the blender. I mean the oil pot. This is on low, right? It's on high. Oh no, low heat. It has to be like medium-ish. I would do six. Are you a chef now? Yeah, because high heat makes it burn. It'll turn black. That's really high. Okay, so I actually know about chefness. No, the thing is that it takes oil takes forever to heat up. Oh, so you've heated it up and now it's gonna be a little yeah. icy, 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 icy. No, do you think this is ready? What do you mean? Hmm. I don't know, I'm not a chef. Uh, we don't know what we're doing, actually. We I never know. I don't think know. they know. These are all people that you take out. These are peasants who eat nothing but rice and potatoes. McDonald's. They eat McDonald's. McDonald's. Okay, let's see what it looks like. Give it a little slightly toss. Okay, okay, okay. That's pretty good. All right, let's keep waiting. It has to be crispy and crunchy. <sighs> if I drop this, it'll be bad. It'll go straight. It'll be the sixth camera you've done that. <laughs> and here's our cheese, by the way. I think this is done. Does it feel crunchy or soft? It feels soft. Let me stick my finger there, sweetie. Get a fork. What do you think? Is this a cheese stick? I don't know. How do we know? Help us, we don't know what we're doing. Honestly, <coughs> it should be fine. <laughs> put a nugget in there. Put a nugget. One nugget. The animals. Mm -hmm. I remember we air fried it and it was not as tasty because we need the oil from the health because this is the health. Well, this is healthy no fat. saturated fat in here. No, this has to be ready. Okay. So you have to cool down. Okay, let me get a fork. It looks ready. No, you should grab your fingers. No, where's the forks? They're all dirty. I'll get them there. <sighs> Cheapers, creepers. Yeah, you can touch it. You, you should grab your fingers. Oh yeah, it feels hard. Yeah, they're ready quickly. Okay, okay. 
Want to do the honors? I will do the honors. <gasps> I love cheese. Da done. I love cheese. I love cheese. Da done. Yes, I do. I do. I love cheese. Da done. We love cheese. Da done. I love cheese. Da done. Yes, I do. I do. We do. All right. It's time to eat. Hopefully it's not too hot. Hello. Can everyone see me? Oh, my God. All right. We're going to get a nice crispy one. First, let me have a bite to just tell you. Mm. Did I like it? Did, oh. did I do a good job? It tastes like fine dining. Oh my god. Mm, 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 mm. Ah. Mm, mm. Oh my god. Okay. Here we go. Click the link below to follow my Patreon. You'll get exclusive weekly videos about my life, plus tons of mukbangs not allowed on YouTube. Link below. Hi, I'm still here. Okay. <clears throat> oh my gosh. Ooh. Oh, this one burnt on the bottom. Ooh. Ooh. Diabetes! Ah! Been there, done that, huh? This is diabetes. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Pops of cheese. It's delicious. <clears throat> Nutritious. And delicious. Okay. <clears throat> I want a nice crispy one. Let's get oh this one crispy. Oh. Here we go. I love cheese. Dun dun. I love cheese. <coughs> <coughs> My body, excuse me. It's just allergies. You're breaking down. It's just allergies. Oh. I love cheese. Dun dun. Yes, I do. I do. <coughs> Try another sweet baby. It's okay. <clears throat> It is so tasty. Come on, get out of here. Ooh, ooh. Mm. <laughs> okay, let's try it again. <sighs> Look at this cheese. I love cheese so much. I love cheese. Yes, I do. I love cheese. How about you? Ooh. 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 Yeah, that's not like custom, right? Do you want another cookie? <laughs> uh-huh. Right. You guys. That looks so good. It's amazing. It's uh, so good. I'm so jealous. Oh. It's so warm. It's so tasty. It has... Protein! 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 It's so funny how in America the fattest people eat the most protein. That's not true. Mm. Oh my god, it is true. Bacon, egg, sausage, grits. I'm gonna say bacon, sausage, grits. What is that song? You know the bacon song? No, it's the sausage. Oh, you guys, I know you're jealous. You people are so jealous of this delicious cheese. That's mozzarella. That's whole mozzarella. Mm. That Galvani cheese is incredible. Mm-hmm. Such good cheese. It's the best. Mm-hmm. 
ass or something. We've been doing the wrong cheese. And I have the wrong cheese. <laughs> <clears throat> Ooh, this one looks real good. Crispy. Oh, yeah. Ooh. Ooh. Help. There we go. Oh. Ooh. They used the spoon. Ooh. Yes, honey. Diabetes. Mm, you're right, I couldn't use this one. Yeah, you're not very funny. I want that much cheese, just a little bit of cheese. Oh! This one is for <clears throat> me and see my lawyer. And that's for Amber? <laughs> She smells like fucks. Anyway. Mm. It's because she's European. That's normal. That's the more. Yeah. Yes, <gasps> No, I'm joking. Is Europe a race? No, it's not. Oh my god. Chicken nugget, here we go. Little chicken nugget. Mmm, it's crispy. Mmm. 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 This food's actually really tasty. I know you guys are so jealous of me. You're so, you're like, wow, I wish I could eat like that. You don't even have to tell me, Ashley. <clears throat> I know you're jealous. I'm catching my breath still. Oh, thank you. Touch the nugget. Okay. Uh, You're such a loser. Anything else, sweetie? You gonna make more mess, sweetie? You owe me 45 calories. <clears throat> you owe me my life. Ooh, burn, burn. Cancel, cancel, cancel. Mm. Oh, 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 look. Mm. Have you ever seen any other YouTuber provide you such quality content? No, you haven't. Oh, look at this. Oh my God, it's folding over. Ooh. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. I just forgot how much I love hash browns. So greasy. Actually, no. I've never forgotten. I've always done. Talk about breakfast. Good hash brown. Uh, Jack in the Box hash brown, good breakfast. Good hash brown. Burger King hash browns, good hash brown. McDonald's hash brown, that's a good hash brown. I hop hash brown, those are good hash browns. Those are hash and hash browns. Chick play hash browns, those are good hash browns. Um,
You would never know they're expired. Honestly, I feel like restaurants might do this kind of sneakily. How would you know? Don't taste expired to me. All right, let's do another chicken nugget. The chicken nuggets are crispy. He did a good job. He was a really good <clears throat> servant. <laughs> okay. Listen to this crunch. Those are fatty. Those are very fatty. These taste really good. Mmm. Check these out. These are like really good. These are way better <clears throat> than I expected. The nuggets are good today. Oh my gosh, ooh. And don't you love how the cheese just keeps going and going and going? Like it never stops. Put a little bit on there, okay. Give it a little blanket. Excuse my runny nose, it's just the cheese. Mm. <sighs> By the way, these were not pan fried, these were deep fried. These were deep fried. Oh my god. So greasy. I love cheese to dun. I love cheese to dun. I love cheese to dun. Yes, I do. <clears throat> Say it with me, everybody. We love cheese. Dun -dun. We love cheese. Dun -dun. We love cheese. Da -dun. Yes, so we do, we do. I love cheese. Da -dun. I love cheese. Da -dun. I love cheese. Da -dun. <laughs> yes, <laughs> we do. We do. Broadway singer, come right up. Oh my god. Oh my god. It's so good. Oh. It's incredible. It's me. I'd like to thank all my patrons for supporting this video and an even bigger thank you to my executive producers, Jamie Baby Cotto, Princess Abby, and C Butter. If you'd like to support my channel a little bit extra, or if you just want to see the real unfiltered side of these videos, click the link in the description box and consider joining all of us over on Patreon. You'll get to see weekly videos and a much more candid side of me. Oh, and by the way, you have to be a grown-up to follow. Patreon's really for my closest followers only, and
and new openings become available on a first come first serve basis. So if you see an opening, hurry up. If you want to hear from me personally, get yourself a video directly from me on Cameo where I can surprise you with a video straight to your phone or your computer. You can also hire me to tell off your friend. If you want more, check out my merch store and get yourself a Waterweight t-shirt. Patreon, Cameo, and merch are all linked in the description box. Thank you so much. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye-bye.